Not just Kanye West, NBA star Kyrie Irving joins anti-Semitic conspiracy bandwagon. All super mega celebrity NBA factor shield Kyrie Irving has come below hearth place for selling an anti-Semitic movie and EEE book on his social media accounts. Eleven though has maintained he has now no longer carried out something wrong. Irving, who performs for the Brooklyn Nets and have become one of the maximum first-rate anti-COVID vaxxers in America in the course of the pandemic, published the hyperlink to a 2018 film called Hebrews to Negroes, Wake Up Black America, primarily based totally on a 2015 EEE book of the identical name. The film, as pronounced via way of means of Rolling Stone, purports to expose the actual reality approximately the slave trades, consisting of that, the Jewish slave ships that added our West African Negro or Bantu ancestors to slave ports owned via way of means of Jews. The film also denounces the mainstream media for centuries as the greatest instrument of indoctrination, brainwashing and propaganda the world has ever seen, and helping Satan deceive the world. The documentary then attributed the fabricated citations to alleged Jewish dominance in society to Ashkenazi Jew, Harold Rosenthal, an aide to the late Senator Jacob Javits. Ms. Explain. The bogus quote first appeared in his 1978 pamphlet by noted anti-Semite Walter White Jr., who had fabricated an interview with Rosenthal to promote an anti-Semitic conspiracy theory. The book further argues that anti-black racism can be traced back to European Jewish writings and Talmud teachings of Judaism, but that Judaism has been defined by Freemasonry, Lucifer, and Satan continues to be associated with it also refers to the Jewish controlled news media, saying that, by controlling our money and the mass media, the Jews of Europe controlled our thinking. The trope pushed in the book and film was finally pushed by Kanye West in the now infamous Tucker Carlson interview. It has been used by extremist groups to promote anti-Semitism. The Jewish belief that this is the case, so-called Jews stole their identity and birthright.